In this video, we will see how to use the drill option. You can analyze the data at different levels using the drilling option. However, to use the drill option, you should have the hierarchy defined at the universe level. Once you have the hierarchy at universe, you can add that object to result objects in query panel. Once you run the query, the object will be added to the list of available objects in a whereby document. Drilling allows you to move to a level up or level down as per the hierarchy in universe. Let us log in to SAP system and see the drilling option in a WebI document. Let's see how you can use the drill option in WebI report. So why we need drilling? So first of all, let's see what we have in this WebI report. I have created this WebI report where I have the year value and then we have the sales revenue. So my drill option will allow the user to go drill down and drill up into a hierarchy. So what is a hierarchy? So let's say if I take the example of the time hierarchy where we have year, quarter, month, week and then we have the day. So when we have the report where we have the year but I want to give the flexibility to the user to drill down from year to quarter, quarter to month, month to week and then to the day. So similarly the user they can go up into the hierarchy using the drill up option. So why we have to use the drill option is we have to provide the more analysis option to the end users. But how my report will know that what is the hierarchy which it has to follow for the drill down or the drill up. So my hierarchy has to be defined into my universe. So first of all for drilling we need to define the hierarchy and then we can drill up or drill down. So if we are creating the web report based on the universe we have to define that hierarchy into the universe. If it's a Bex query then we have to define the hierarchy at the Bex level. So we have to define the hierarchy before we use the drill option in Webby. So here we already have the time hierarchy defined into the universe. So now let's see how we can use that in the report. So first of all, we have to enable the drill into the report if we want to use that option. So if we go to the analysis, we have this drill option. So if I click on this drill, now I have the drilling available into my report. If I go to this, I, I have this option of drill down to quarter. So why I got this option now? Because I have enabled the drill. If I disable this, I won't be having this option of drill down. Now, if I click on drill down to quarter, I can see that now my data is gone into the next level which is quarter. Then if I go here, then it is showing that the next level is drill down to month. I will click on it and it will go into the month level data. Similarly, it will go into the week level data and after that it will go into the holiday level data. Now, I am at the lowest level of this hierarchy, so it is not giving me an option of the drill down. Whereas, I can go drill up into the hierarchy now. So, I can drill up. To the week. After that I can drill up to the month. I can drill up to the quarter. Similarly I can drill up to the year now. So this is how you can use the drilling option into the web report. So first of all you have to define the hierarchy at your data source level. Then you have to enable drill into your report and after that you can use the drill up and the drill down into the report. So your drilling option is enabled even in the reading mode. So if, if the users are in the reading mode, they can still drill up and drill down into your hierarchical data in the web report. So in this tutorial, we have seen how we can use the drill down and drill up in the web report. Thank you.